हेलो स्टूडेंट हाई गुड इवनिंग सो टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस अबाउट इलेक्ट्रो मैग्नेटिक वेव ओके सो इलेक्ट्रो इलेक्ट्रो मैग्नेटिक इलेक्ट्रो मैग्नेटिक इलेक्ट्रो मैग्नेटिक वेव वेव ओके इलेक्ट्रो मैग्नेटिक वेव दिस इज माई इलेक्ट्रो मैग्नेटिक वेव ओके सो टुडे वी वॉन्ट टू सी अबाउट दिस वॉट इज दिस इलेक्ट्रो मैग्नेटिक वेव विच इज नथिंग बट लाइट Your light is also what electromagnetic wave. What do you mean by electromagnetic wave? If you see electro, electromagnetic wave means electro, electro plus magnetic, electro plus magnetic plus wave plus wave. Okay. So electro means what? If you see here, electro means electric field electro means electric field electric field electric field and mag magnetic means this is my magnetic field magnetic field magnetic field and this wave means what wave is nothing but propagation of disturbance this is what propagation propagation of disturbance propagation of disturbance disturbance of what disturbance of disturbance of em wave em electromagnetic okay propagation of disturbance of electric electric and and magnetic 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 field electric and magnetic field within the medium within within the medium within the medium okay so this means what if you see here electro means electric field magnetic field wave means propagation of disturbance of electric and magnetic field within the medium so means electromagnetic wave electromagnetic wave as we see the light is also electromagnetic wave electromagnetic wave means without this electromagnetic wave we are a bird okay so this whole of the whole of the world this whole of the universe it is what it is surrounded by electromagnetic wave if you will see whole of the universe whole of the universe is actually this is what surrounded by this electromagnetic wave and this electromagnetic wave is a like like what it's like a fabric okay it's like a fabric fabric in whole of the universe okay this is like a fabric it's like a sheet sheet okay fabric so this is what em electromagnetic wave electromagnetic wave is like a fabric in this whole of the universe universe whole of the universe it's like a fabric okay fabric so is see if i will disturb this fabric then what will happen so disturbance this disturbance will get what propagated propagated throughout the space propagated throughout the space see just giving the disturbance some disturbance to this to this what fabric to this fabric of electromagnetic wave is nothing but it is a light and this light is ultimately a electromagnetic wave okay you are able to see me you are able to see surrounding you okay so at a day time because of this electromagnetic wave okay without the electromagnetic wave this whole of the world is what this whole of the world is dark okay you are in the dark without this electromagnetic electromagnetic wave okay so whatever you are doing day to day life in your life because of this electromagnetic wave okay because of this you are able to see the object whatever object you will see at a day time okay whatever the energy you are getting because of this okay so that's why you have to give the value for this to understand okay so this is what this is like a fabric in the whole of the universe whole of the universe so ultimately that is a electromagnetic fabric so now we will see what actually this is okay how it is 
So this means ele electron means electric field. Electric field means what? Electric field means this is what electric field. This is the field that is established around what charge because of charge. Electric field means it is coming from the charge Q. Q coulomb of charge is there. Okay. If there is a charge means surrounding this charge there is what field. Field. That field is nothing but there is a field. Okay. What type of field is this? Electric field. Electric field. So this charge, this charge will what create the force, force, force surrounding it. This is my positive charge. Let's say this is my positive charge. Then, then there is a field, field. What type of field? This is what diverging field, diverging field. So this is my field. Okay, diverging outside, outside. This is my field because of this positive charge, this positive charge. How you, how I will feel that that. Field here, if some other charge is there, like negative charge, okay, this is negative charge. When this negative charge will come, will come this in, this is like a aura, aura, this is like a aura or vibes, okay, positive vibes, positive radiation, okay. Once this negative charge will come in the contact, in the contact of this, in the contact of this field, then it will get attracted by this this what positive charge. This charge will fill this force, okay, so this is what field. Field is created wherever the charge is there. Let us say charge is there. Okay. So then this charge will create some what this charge will create some field. Field surrounding this. So this field is nothing but electric field. Okay. Electric field. This electric field is nothing but force per unit charge. How much force is how much force? We are applying on unit charge is nothing but electric field. This is what electric field. Okay, so like like some person is there, like your friend is there. Okay, if your friend, if you let's say if your friend like Sham, okay, Sham is your friend and you are Ram. Okay, so here is a Ram, there is a Sham, and this Sham is very positive person, very optimistic person. Then it will radiate what type of vibes? Positive vibes. Okay, positive vibes. And this this Sham, this is what Ram, and this is Sham. This Sham is somewhat negative, means it has somewhat less knowledge then he want to attract some knowledge from this run okay so then it will attract toward the run toward the run opposite charge always attract with each other so therefore that is coulombic force of attraction between these okay so this force per unit charge how much force is there so this is nothing but my electric field so this is what actually actually electric field how electric field is distinguished because of this because of this charge in the presence of charge wherever the charge is there electric field is there <coughs> electric field is there that electric field is nothing but vibes positive vibes or negative vibes depending on the depending on the charge okay whether it is positive charge if it is positive then positive vibes will get emanated from that okay from this charge and if it is negative charge then positive <laughs> negative vibes will get eliminated from this then field will get what converts converts if it is negative means negative field will the field electric field will get converts converts okay it will come toward negative charge so this is a type of electric field now this is force per unit charge now see if we if you will see that this is my positive charge okay so this is my positive charge here let's see this is my positive charge okay positive charge if this positive charge is what stationary stationary this positive charge is stationary okay stationary charge then it will what it will produce what it will produce electric field stationary electric field static electric field these electric field are what static electric field static means this charge is at, at stationary so therefore there is a field of what what type of field static electric field static electric field okay so static electric field and now another way now i am saying that if this charge is moving okay if this charge is moving moving with constant velocity with constant constant velocity if this charge will move with constant velocity constant velocity if this charge will move with constant constant velocity okay if this charge will move with constant velocity then there is what there is a current as you know very well what the current is nothing but rate of change of charge okay with respect to time with respect to time so this is nothing but dq by dt dq by dt if it is changing with time so this is nothing but constant flow of charge constant flow of charge means it will give what dc current current 
okay current it will give current once current is there then if there is a current if there is a current current means there is a magnetic field what magnetic field that is static magnetic field okay static magnetic field if this charge is what what i am saying if this charge is moving with constant velocity first i said what first i said if the charge is stationary if the charge is stationary then it will generate what a uh, static electric field okay if this charge will start moving if this charge will start moving with constant velocity then it will generate then it then this charge moving charge will give us give us what magnetic field magnetic field of what constant constant amplitude constant amplitude so it will generate the magnetic field of constant constant amplitude okay if the charge is moving with constant velocity it will give what it will give magnetic field it will give magnetic field magnetic field magnetic field of magnetic field of constant magnitude constant amplitude constant amplitude amplitude constant ampli amplitude okay so this is what if charge is moving with constant velocity with constant velocity so now <clears throat> if charge is moving with constant velocity it will give us what it will give us magnetic field of constant constant amplitude okay constant amplitude so constant amplitude so this is what moving charge with constant velocity with constant constant with constant velocity velocity constant velocity will give us what will give us magnetic field will give us magnetic field magnetic field field of constant field of constant amplitude constant amplitude okay constant amplitude if if what if this positive charge is moving with constant velocity okay so moving with constant moving with constant velocity if charge is moving with constant velocity it will give magnetic field of constant amplitude okay constant amplitude so therefore there is a static so there is what there is a electric field of constant magnitude magnetic field of constant magnitude but it is not changing at all okay it is not changing at all this is only when the charge is moving when the charge will start moving when the charge will start moving then there is what current if there is a current there is a magnetic field but this magnetic field is a type of what it is a type of constant amplitude constant amplitude or we can say it's like a dc current dc current okay so dc current dc electric field dc magnetic field okay so if the charge is moving with constant velocity similarly if i will say that this is my charge positive charge if it is moving with different velocity if it is if it is moving with what moving with if it is moving with different velocity means it is accelerating okay moving i can say it is moving it is moving with with different with different velocity okay it, it is moving with different different velocity different velocity if this charge is moving with different velocity means means what this implies that it is also it is accelerating accelerating charge accelerating charge it is accelerating charge okay accelerating charge or you can say it is a oscillating charge oscillating oscillating charge charge is oscillating so now this charge oscillating charge if the charge is moving with a different velocity different velocity means rate of change of velocity rate of change of velocity okay so rate of change of velocity is nothing but acceleration acceleration means what oscillation oscillation means what if the charge is what oscillating if the charge is oscillating so this is my charge positive charge this is my negative charge okay it is coming closer to each other okay so this charge is what oscillating oscillating okay back and forth it is oscillating means back and forth means what this oscillating charge will generate what this oscillating charge will give us what will give us magnetic field now this magnetic field of different magnitude okay different magnitude therefore the charge moving with different velocity means it is oscillating charge means it, it will generate what current okay it will generate current if there is a current okay current if there is a current means then there is a magnetic field 
here is a magnetic field we should know that when the charge is moving then moving charge is nothing but flow of charge is nothing more than current nothing more than current once current is there once current is there magnetic field is there okay so magnetic field is there what type of magnetic field is this this magnetic field is nothing but this magnetic field is nothing but it is a different different amplitude different amplitude of magnetic field it will generate so this is what time varying time varying electric field if the charge is oscillating if the charge is oscillating then the electric field is also changing with the time changing with the time so this is what this is how we can see that this is very important if you see this this is my charge this is what this is my let's say this is my conductor conductor within this conductor there is a charge yes there is a positive charge okay there is a negative charge there is a positive charge there is a negative charge and this charge is coming closer to each other closer to each other this charge is coming closer to each other okay so this this means what <laughs> closer to each other if you see this is positive charge positive this is positive and this is my negative charge and this is positive charge and this is my negative charge and this is my positive charge this is negative charge coming closer to each other coming very close to each other now this negative will go up positive will come down now this positive will go further down and this will come up okay so this negative charge again it will go further up and this positive charge will come down okay so now again they will come very close to each other so this is what positive charge this is my negative charge coming very close to each other and this negative charge this positive charge coming very close to each other like this so like there this charge this charge is what oscillating oscillating okay so back and forth so now like this electric field is also it will create the electric field so see here electric field from positive to negative positive to negative positive to negative electric field small amplitude small amplitude amplitude this is small amplitude now it is opposite electric field okay so now electric field opposite now this is somewhat bigger then this is much bigger and this is somewhat small okay so this is what if you see these are the electric field electric field okay so small amplitude small so then this is small again this will come down this okay so this is this will come down and again increasing increasing downward increasing downward so this is what electric field if you will plot this this electric field is something moving like this okay so this electric field is moving like this this is my electric field yes electric field because of what because of what it is happening because of oscillation of charge charge is accelerating charge is accelerating once the charge accelerate so this field will also field will also vary with the time this electric field will vary with the time very big time okay very big time so therefore the whatever the current current because we know very well once the charge will start moving then there is, that is nothing but current current is what current is nothing but nothing more than the flow of charge flow of charge is nothing but current once the current is there magnetic field is there magnetic field is there first we have seen what first we have seen when the charge is when the charge is moving when the charge is moving with different constant velocity constant velocity that time it will it will generate the con it will generate the electric field of constant magnitude and there is a current and the current once the current is there there is a magnetic field and that magnetic field is also have a constant amplitude constant amplitude now in that case what we are saying we are saying that this charge is now this charge is now moving with a different velocity moving with different velocity means velocity is changing with respect to time okay so with respect to time which means that which means that this charge is this charge is accelerating this charge is accelerating this charge is accelerating means this charge is oscillating oscillating once it is oscillating it is generating what time varying electric field time varying electric field now as we know very well from maxwell from maxwell equation what from maxwell equation maxwell equation that time varying time varying electric field will generate magnetic field yes magnetic field this is what del cross h is equal to del cross h is equal to j okay j plus j plus epsilon do e vector by do t do e vector by do t yes so do e vector by do t so this is what rate of change of electric field generate the magnetic field generate magnetic field change in electric field generate magnetic field magnetic field so now magnetic field will get generated because of this because of this what 
change in magnetic field change in magnetic field so similarly if you see here this is my this is my what let's say this is my current so surrounding this there is a what magnetic field there is magnetic field <coughs> Now this magnetic field will change like this. Okay, once it will come like this, and again it will come vertical. It will come flat. It will come vertical. It will come flat like this. This is what this is what changing changing what this is changing magnetic field. Yes, this is what magnetic field generation. Magnetic field generation because of a time varying electric field. Okay, time varying electric field as we know very well from Maxwell equation. Maxwell equation. Change in magnet, change in electric field will generate the magnetic field, which is also time varying. Which is also time varying, time varying magnetic field. Okay. So if you if you will see here, so this is like, this is like this. Okay. So this is like this and this. So this is my magnetic field. You can say this is my magnetic field. So this is my electric field. Both are both are normal to each other. Okay. So both are normal to each other. This is my electric field. This is my electric field. Electric field. Electric field. So this is my electric field. This is my magnetic field, which is perpendicular or normal to each other. Okay. So normal to each other. So you can see like this. Normal. Both are normal to each other. Okay. Both are normal to each other. So this. So this is my what? This is my rate of change of what? Electric field and magnetic field. So change in electric field. Change in this is this is my electric field and this this one is my magnetic field. Magnetic field. Okay. Magnetic field. So magnetic field. Change in electric field will generate a magnetic field. This is what propagation of electromagnetic wave. Propagation of electromagnetic wave. In this in this way the electromagnetic wave generate. Okay. Electromagnetic wave generate. What is actual source of electromagnetic generation is nothing but oscillation of charge. If there is a oscillation of charge, if there is a oscillation of charge, then there is a there is a what there is a time varying electric field. Okay, time varying electric field. Once the time varying electric field is there, then by Maxwell, then by Maxwell we can we know that we know that time varying electric field generate magnetic field generate what magnetic field. Okay, so in this way we are generating in this way the electromagnetic electromagnetic wave will get generated. Okay, so which is time varying, which is time varying, and it is a automatic process. It is a automatic propagation propagation of this wave throughout the space throughout the space. Once once the charge will start oscillating. What is the main source? What is the main source? Is nothing but oscillation of charge. Oscillation of charge. So now oscillation of charge. So this is what how we can generate. That. Electromagnetic wave. Electromagnetic wave. So, what is how the light? If if someone will say that how actually the light light is electromagnetic wave. First of all, you see this. This is my this is my AC source. This is my AC source. Okay. So this is my AC voltage. Let's say this is my AC voltage. VAC. Okay. So I am connected this with some conductor. Conductor. Okay. So now there is a charge. Positive charge. Negative charge. Okay, I get the supply of what? Let's say F is equal to or F is equal to 10 kilohertz. 10 kilohertz. F is equal to 10 kilohertz. Okay, 10 kilohertz. So this charge will start oscillating. This charge will start oscillating. Okay. So now this charge will start oscillating, and I will connect this to an to an antenna. To an antenna. What is antenna? Antenna is a device which will convert this oscillation because this is charge. Charge oscillation is there means current oscillation. Current oscillation. This is my voltage V. V oscillation. Current oscillation. V oscillation. This this is like antenna. So antenna. Okay. So there is an oscillation of V L. V and L. Voltage and current oscillation. Okay. I am oscillating this charge means I am oscillating current. Current oscillation and voltage oscillation is there. I am oscillating this charge at the frequency of 10 kilohertz. 10 kilohertz. Okay. 10 kilohertz means there is a 10,000 of 10,000 of cycle that is passing okay through a particular point in one circuit means I am oscillating this charge 10,000 times 10,000 times then after that this VI oscillation I want to what I want to radiate radiate through the space for that radiation what we require we require an antenna we require an antenna so let's say I have connected here this is my transmission line Okay, so let's say this is my transmission line and this is my antenna. This is type of antenna means let's say this is a type of dipole antenna. Dipole antenna. 
So this dipole antenna, length of this dipole antenna is like that's it. This is a lambda by two. Lambda by two. So lambda by two. So this is this antenna is also a conductor. Conductor which is nothing but the conductor whose length is whose length is comparable to the wavelength of the signal. Then it will start radiating. It will start radiating. This is my VI oscillation. Okay, VI oscillation will get radiating throughout the space in the form of EM wave. Who will who will convert this VI oscillation into the EM wave into the EM wave? Who will convert? Who will convert this VI oscillation? VI oscillation means voltage current oscillation. Who will convert this V voltage current oscillation into the EM wave? EM wave through the space. This antenna. Antenna. So antenna is what antenna is one type one type of device that will what that will that will convert the VI oscillation voltage current oscillation into EM wave. Okay. Whose length is lambda by two? As we know very well, any conductor length if it is comparable to the wavelength of the signal, then it will start radiating. It will start radiating any conductor. Okay, so this is this is the way. So now this is what up to ten kilohertz. Yes, up to ten kilohertz. Now if I will start, if I will if I will oscillate this charge at what at ten to the power ten to the power ten hertz. Ten to the power ten hertz means ten gigahertz. Ten gigahertz. Yes, ten gigahertz. If I will radiate. Okay, so you see here there is a need of what <coughs> antenna at ten kilohertz. I need antenna. Yes, I need antenna of some height, lambda by two. Yes, yeah, at ten, at ten gigahertz. And if I will oscillate this this charge at ten gigahertz, then what happen? If I will oscillate this charge at ten gigahertz, means ten gigahertz, ten to the power ten time, I am oscillating this charge within the second, within a second. Then at that time, this is what that time, this is my what conductor. Let's see, this is my conductor. Okay, conductor. Now this charge, now this charge, don't this charge won't won't. Want to sit within this conductor. Want to live within this conductor, and it will start radiating. What? It will start radiating. Why? Because this much high frequency, this much high frequency, no charge, no charge want to sit, no charge want to live within the conductor at all, at all. Why? This much frequency, 10 gigahertz frequency. Do you know how much big this frequency is? Means 10 to the power 10. 10 to the power 10 hertz means 10 to the power 10. Hertz means this many time you are oscillating this charge. You are oscillating this charge. Once you will oscillate this charge this much, if you see the if you see the wavelength of the signal, lambda is equal to c by f, c by f. So this is what c by f, three into ten to the power eight divided by frequency is how much? Ten to the power ten. So this means lambda is equal to how much? Lambda is equal to three into ten to the power minus two. Means it is three centimeter. Three centimeter. Three centimeter means this conductor. This conductor length. If you see, this conductor length is comparable, comparable to the wavelength of the signal. Wavelength of the signal. Once it will come in this contact, this conductor will start radiating. Conductor will start radiating. Why? Because this charge, this charge won't leave, won't leave at all within this conductor at this much high frequency. So therefore, in this type of what, in this type of conductor, there is no need of what antenna. There is no need of antenna. Automatically, it will start radiating. It will start radiating. Okay. Automatically, it will start radiating. Radiating from this. From this. It will start radiating from this. From this conductor itself. This much high frequency. This is what charge. Only what is this charge? Charge is oscillating. Charge is oscillating. How many times? How many times? Ten to the power ten. Ten is oscillating. Oscillating. If something will oscillate at this much, this much speed, so they, they, then this charge won't leave. This charge won't leave within this conductor at this high frequency. So therefore, that is the reason that this, this what this conductor will automatically start radiating itself. Radiating itself means these are these charge oscillation is directly, directly what directly radiating in the form of what electromagnetic wave. Electromagnetic wave. Okay, so there is no need of antenna. Antenna up to you can use antenna up to megahertz range, up to megahertz range in transmission line. Once it will come microwave range, means the length of the antenna will become comparable to the wavelength of the signal. That time the conductor will start radiating. Okay, so that's why if you see this sun, so this is what sun. Yes, this is my beautiful sun. So this is my beautiful what sun. Okay, so sun. This sun is what this sun. This sun has what this is. There is there is a lot of electrons. There is a lot of charge. Charge means electron. Positive charge, negative charge. These charges are oscillating. These charges are oscillating in sun. Within the sun, there is a charge. Lot of charge. Positive charge, negative charge. 
these are not these are oscillating oscillating within this okay within this with the what with the velocity of this much with the frequency of this much okay this much frequency which tend in the order of gigahertz gigahertz or terahertz terahertz these charges are what oscillating in the sun okay so therefore this sun therefore the, this therefore these are these charges are radiating okay so therefore this sun is radiating radiating what energy radiating energy okay this sun is radiating energy this energy radiation what is the source source is nothing but oscillation of charge charge is oscillating so then after that it is coming throughout the space through the ionosphere then after that it will it will stack on your body and you will feel the heat so that heat is nothing but energy so therefore after all the electromagnetic wave it carry the energy what type it carry the energy with this that energy is nothing but some type of disturbance 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 that is given to the fabric okay so as i told you that in this whole of the universe is whole of the universe is surrounded by electric field and magnetic field we are disturbing that field okay so you see here this is what this is what positive charge okay so positive charge and it is generate so it generate what electric field okay so there is a electric field okay electric field if i will give some disturbance if i will give some disturbance to this charge this charge this charge will start oscillating once this charge will start oscillating means there is a breaking of this there is a there is a breaking of breaking of this electric field this is not breaking this is just a kin here okay so this is what kin here so means this is some disturbance disturbance here this disturbance is what nothing but this is what disturbance these are the disturbance what i did just i started oscillating this charge okay so once this charge start oscillating this kin this is what link so we can say let's say this is what disturbance okay so this disturbance will start radiating only this this disturbance is what radiating okay so what is this disturbance is nothing but energy energy okay so energy which is carried by electromagnetic wave which is carried by electric and magnetic field okay so electromagnetic wave electromagnetic wave is a carrier wave is a carrier which carry the energy which carry the energy some type of information okay through information within that within this within this wave okay so electromagnetic wave <clears throat> because the electromagnetic wave is nothing but there is electric field magnetic field in whole of the universe is surrounded by electric field and magnetic field we are just giving this disturbance to this to this electric field disturbance given disturbance means we are that charge is oscillating oscillation of charge will give the disturbance to this field okay so that disturbance is nothing but the energy and that disturbance is nothing but energy in the form of some information okay some information so that you want to send some information to someone okay your information is nothing but that is disturbance okay so that disturbance is carried by what electromagnetic wave throughout the space for the space which is traveling at the speed of light at the speed of light means 300 lakh kilometer per second it will reach to your it will reach to your friend okay so within within a second within a second this much amount of information is carried by this electromagnetic wave okay electromagnetic wave toward your friends okay so this is what this is the this is actually this is actually the light so this is what sunlight yes sunlight okay so this is what from here you are able to understand how the light is electromagnetic wave in this way the light is electromagnetic wave you can say the light is electromagnetic wave how then you can you can say that there is a sun sun has what lot of charge positive charge negative charge those charges are oscillating those charges are changing oscillating okay oscillating with different velocity okay accelerating charge at the rate of what 10 gigahertz like in the order of terahertz so at this frequency the charge won't leave at all within this sun so they so that's why they are starting radiating they will start radiating from this sun and this radiation is coming in the form of energy in the form of energy this radiation is nothing but electromagnetic wave radiation is nothing more than electromagnetic wave which is carrying the energy which is carrying the energy like heat heat energy okay so it will start radiating throughout the space and uh, through the ionosphere then after that it will come to earth and it will strike your body 
so when you will when you will be within the sun okay so under the sun you will you will feel the heat that heat is nothing but energy energy which is carried by electromagnetic wave okay electromagnetic wave and also you are able to see you are able to see this whole of the world whatever you are seeing day to day life okay so in your whole of the life this electromagnetic wave without this electromagnetic wave you can't live at all in this earth okay so this much importance of this about electromagnetic wave okay so there is a lot of information about this electromagnetic wave and we will come by small small lecture okay so this is just how electromagnetic wave generate okay how the light is electromagnetic wave now i think you are very much clear how the light is electromagnetic wave so this is very good example of sun sun has lot of charges that is positive either positive charge negative charge they are oscillating they are accelerating at the speed at the frequency of 10 gigahertz and in at this high much at this this high frequency these charges these charges won't live at all within the sun so they, that's why they are start emanating from the sun and they are start radiating they start radiating from the sun this radiation is nothing but this oscillation of charge is directly converted di directly converted into electromagnetic wave means they are disturbing what they are disturbing the electric field and magnetic field which is associated which is associated within what within the whole of the universe okay so that is that's why this oscillation means this oscillation is giving a disturbance giving what disturbance to this electric field and magnetic field as you know very well that wave is nothing more than the wave is what what is wave wave is nothing but it is the propagation of disturbance propagation of disturbance through the medium propagation of disturbance through the medium is nothing but wave so that's why it is an electromagnetic wave electromagnetic wave so the disturbance given by disturbance given by the charge oscillation of charge disturbance given by the oscillation of the charge to the field of like electric field and magnetic field that is generated from this source from this sun okay in the form of electromagnetic wave and it is carrying this disturbance as a energy as a energy disturbance as a energy okay as a energy and it is radiating throughout the space throughout the space and reaching to the earth okay so and it will stack or Stack to your body and you will feel heat. So that heat is nothing but actually disturbance. Okay. So that heat is nothing but energy. Energy. Okay. Energy. So that. Okay. So this is what energy. Heat is nothing but information in the form of. In the. This is heat. Heat is nothing but information. Yes. That is information is nothing but energy. Energy. Okay. So that's. That's all about this electromagnetic field. Electromagnetic field. So next time we will come again about this electromagnetic wave, how it travels through the space. Okay. So that's all for today. Uh, knowing about electromagnetic field. Okay. So thank you very much. Okay.